Well, good evening again. I guess it's been a few days since we did worship, but um, here we are again now. So I'm going to be singing from Revelation today, chapter 3. And the first song will be Revelation 3, verse 8. And it, not too many people are familiar with it. So let's see. Um. Revelation 3 verse 20 and it goes today and your blessings that we were able to have a good weekend and serve you. Please bless those who have not heard of your love yet and help us to be able to reach them, to teach people about Jesus and help us to resist evil when it comes to us and to not look down on others because we know that we ourselves are in great need of your mercy. Bless us, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, so today we were reading from Psalms chapter 10, and it goes over, well, I'll just read a few work verses for you. Um, the first verse says, Why standest thou afar off, O Lord? Why hidest thou thyself in times of trouble? The wicked his, in his pride doth persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the devices that they have imagined. So David's asking God, like, why do you let the wicked prosper, you know? Uh, why does it seem like the poor are always oppressed? But if we look, read down a little bit farther, it talks about the wicked and how they are proud in their own sins. And then in verse 14 it says, Thou hast seen it, for thou beholdest mischief and spite to requite it with thy hand. The poor committed himself unto thee, thou art the helper of the fatherless. Break thou the arm of the wicked and the evil man, seek out his wickedness till thou find none. The Lord is king for ever and ever, the heathen are perished out of his land. Lord, thou hast heard the desire of the humble, thou wilt prepare their heart, thou wilt cause thine ear to hear, to judge the fatherless and the oppressed, that the man of the earth may no more oppress. So we can take from this chapter, sometimes we don't understand why God allows wicked in the world, but there's coming a day that he will, he will judge the fatherless, he will judge the oppressed people, he will, he will take the side of the humble. So it's our job to be patient and keep serving, keep loving, and just be strong. Well, <clears throat> have a good night. <laughs> I'm kind of tired tonight, so I'll make this short. God bless.